Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Nairo from Phantom Production. Today I have a tutorial for you guys. I want to show you on how to make a, a beat if you have an acapella. Let's say if you have a client who come with a project and say you guys should do a production in a song which they have already written it, how will you go about it? Uh, let's say I want to demonstrate with, a, with an acapella. Let's say I'm singing something like Ada, Ada, oh, 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 Ada. You so, you so beautiful. Ada. So if I have such an acapella and I want to do a bit with first thing first, I will try to figure out the tempo in which I'm singing, meaning it's simple the speed at which I'm singing. So let's first thing we do is to just to put on your metronome and start singing and try to figure out the tempo. So let's put our metronome and see. Now it's fast. Let's bring it down. Let's put it on hundred and see. Ada, Ada, oh, oh. The tempo is still fast. So, so let's take it down. Ada, Ada, oh, oh, oh. Da. You so, you so beautiful. Ada. It's still fast. It will cause me to sing faster than what I want to sing. So I will step it down, be listening to the tempo, and see the one that will work well. So I will just be stepping it down. Okay, let's see this tempo, if I can sing with this one. Ada, Ada, oh, 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 Ada. You so, you so beautiful. Ada. Okay, I think I will sing, I can sing with this tempo. The next thing we do is just go to your audio settings, right? Select the microphone. Okay, so let's record following our metronome. So that's all you do. If you are able to figure out the tempo, let's record. Ada, Ada, oh, 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 Ada. You so, you so beautiful. Ada. You so, you so beautiful. Ada. So now that I've recorded, I can just play and listen to what I have. After the playing, I'll just start structuring some drums. So, first of all, you try to listen to it and you just imagine what you want to do and you think of what type of brand you want to do the song. Is it an Afro type or is it a, just imagine anything with uh, uh, what comes on your mind. The next thing is just to select some drums. You can go to your sample pack and you select some drums that you want to use. So let me just select some drums then we'll be back. Select this snare, this one, I hat I've just selected those stuff, okay. so. The next thing we can do is uh, maybe we'll play hi hat so with a metronome we we'll listen to Ada Ada So that's the acapella. You so you so beautiful Ada So uh I'll just swing it to 33. So what I'll do is I will just put I just want to play something that will give me a groove for me to start uh, playing the melodies and so on. So we'll just do something like this on the hi hat and be listening to it. Ada, Ada. The next thing we we'll do is uh, we we'll try to use a snare, and we have this snare here and this one. Maybe we'll just play something like this. So let's put a snare. Ada. Let's figure it out. Ada. 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 
So the next instruments are, let's just see this one. So let's try a position that you can deem it convenient. Let's try here. Ada. 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 Maybe the next thing is for us to look for a kick drum and, and work with it. We'll just try this one. So let's do this. So we can just do it. Too. Okay. Ada. Ada. So beautiful. So uh we'll just leave the drums like that. Then the next thing we'll do, we'll just try to figure out the instruments we'll be playing. So when you have an acapella like this, first thing you try to figure out the chord progression. So we don't know. But now uh processing which I usually use to get my chord progression is to use my ears. So when I hear like ah da ah 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 understand try to figure out the the key with my ears but uh, if you have any issues with that let me try to do another method how we can figure out the key for now i don't know the key of the song so what i do is uh so what i'll do is i'll just go here i go to edit sample it will automatically take all the the audio sample to edit scene i will right click like this i'll go to tools i'll convert convert i go now to go to convert to score and down to piano roll. So we do that. Okay, as you can see, you see what they've done here. It has converted, send it to the piano roll. We'll go to a piano roll. So with all this convert, the sound that has done, so I don't really need all those stuff. So what I want to figure out now here is the, the first root note. So the first root note here is G. This is G. I don't know if it's a G major or a minor. So what I'll do, I'll go here to, I'll go to view, I'll go to scale highlighting like this, I snap the grid now to, to G. But now we don't know if it's a minor or a major. Okay guys, so what I'll do, since I already know that the first root note is G, what I'll do, I'll just put it on major like this. Then now what I'll do, all this, all this stuff like this, I'll delete them. They are of no use, so I'll just delete it. Cut it off. So we'll cut it off like that. Then I'll go back to my piano roll. So the first root note is G. So I'll, I'll play G. So, so I want to do a chord progression. It's on G, right? Ada. Okay, let's go to major. So let's listen if it's a major or a minor. I think it's a major. We'll allow it a major. Ada. So now look for the next. You just put it here. Ada. It didn't go well, so we step it down again. We are looking for a, a progression. A nice chord progression that we'll use for it. So, Ada. so I'll just do two fingers like this. So the next thing, let me put this one to a triad again. Ada. The next progression will be up. Ada. Something like that. Ada. No. Okay, let's listen again. Ada. 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 Okay, let's see this. I think this here would do. Ada. 
we've gotten our code progression the next thing is save so what we'll do let's we'll just copy the code progression like this put it on the stream okay let's make the guitar to uh, sound a little bit uh, interesting and just come here now and try to do something like this and just cut it maybe something like this so the next thing we can do we can just add uh we can just do a note like this do something like this so i wouldn't want this video to be too long so i want i want just to give you the idea so in your own case you can take time like this and this uh, guitar you play with the you play with the velocity so but i don't want us to waste uh, much time for that do everything play the sound that you like so we'll just leave this one like this but i believe you gotten the idea let's just listen to it Ada. Ada. So the next thing is for us to just play the bass. I've just copied this chord progression and pasted it here so we can see it and just follow the, the chord progression. So what we do, you can just follow the progression like this. So let's listen to what we have. Hey. Yes, up. She knows sabi cook, no sabi wash. She is fat, but me I know. Maybe you want to spice your your bass a little bit so or you can do you can do something like like this maybe something like mm -hmm. if you want to still repeat here you can still do it like this so let's listen she knows sabi cook no sabi wash she is fat but me i know Just play around, put notes, and make the make it look interesting. You understand? So I think we are going somewhere. So I believe you really understand the idea. So. So in the beginning, if you want to part, maybe we'll just take out the kick. To the acapella was this okay tell this one so let's listen to it Ada. Ada. you so you so beautiful Ada. you so you so beautiful So I believe you've gotten the idea how you can program your own song if you have a client. So I am Naira again from Phantom Production and my goal is to help you get better. Uh, if you're new to the channel, subscribe to our channel, also hit the notification bell. So whenever we upload content like this, you wouldn't get to miss out. Thanks for watching.